these words are not my own They're from wolf bows Was lost but now he's found There was a time not long ago Streams bore us forth Not with the ever delicious cream soda but with mundane murk of water, skies hazed over, pale and blue and a faint hint of cloud. Whispering of overcast soon to come, nights ridden with the glassy milk of the same faint stars that have been ever present. Forever the same, for countless eons, all was predictable, all was knowable. A pretty scene to behold, no doubt, but one trapped in the ever changelessness that left those experiencing it. In a state devoid of anticipation In short Boredom I think he's talking about Reddit Burst forth from the pale tundra Sprung a palace From which Intrigue erupted those who had traveled these lands for years Had since grown tired of the atmosphere and let it be Thus the palace was maintained In secrecy Those travelers fortunate to stumble upon it Were drawn from their boring lives into a myriad of fanciful popsicles and gummy bear kisses. How then, you asked, did wolf bows come across this beautiful vision? Well, he met a traveler from an antique land who said, Two vast and trunkless legs of stone stand in the desert, near them on the sand. Half sunk, a shattered visage lies whose frown and wrinkled lip and sneer of cold command. Tell that its sculptor well those passions red, which survive stamped on these lifeless things. The hand that mocked them and the heart that fed And on the pedestal these words appear My name is Saddam I'm the king of kings Look on my works, ye mighty and despair Where nothing beside remains Around the decay of that class so and bear the lone and level sand stretch far away lost in the sea of a never changing as my fellow traveler grew weary that out of such a lonesome and barren desert such majesties could spring forth. Intrigued, I set out searching for the subject of this tale. And I never found it. Rather the secret palace found me. I shall be telling this with a sigh. Some ages and ages hence wolf bows traveled into the unknown and the unknown beckoned him. And that is 
is why we are here today. <laughs>